Hi, it's me, Yuha Masaki. And Yuriko Hira. And welcome to a brand new episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review! <laughs> I don't know about you, girl, but I'm actually really excited to be here with you. Me first too. Of all. I miss this. I, haven't seen I have her in not forever. seen her since the finale. I know, really, literally. So today we're tooting and booting the looks of RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars 4 on their social media. Let's talk about our first little lady. Yes, it's Naomi Small. Come on, legs, legs, legs on the menu. I love this. Obviously, Naomi always is painted. Her eye makeup is beautiful. Exactly. She looks like the only woman. She's got her glow on. Exactly, exactly. She looks like, every time she does her eye makeup like that, it reminds me that she has a little twinkle in her eye. A little twinkle. Oh, it's true. And look at those collarbones, girl. I like the gold blonde hair. It matches beautifully with the cheetah. She's got all the accessories on. One thing that I know about Naomi Smalls is she loves to accessorize. So she's gonna have like four bracelets on each wrist, three rings on, a necklace, earrings. She's gonna be accessorized for the gods, but it always works on her. And I think she can actually wear anything and still look beautiful. It is structured the way that it's supposed to be. And let me take a look at the necklace. It's like that black fringe kind of necklace. Yeah, I like it. I love the way she accessorizes. I have to keep going back to accessories. And she puts on this small button earring, which balances it out, versus having on like a huge earring plus a necklace. Um, I give it a two. I give it a two too. I give it a two. I mean, I give the setting and the lighting a boot though. All right, next up is Miss La 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 Latrice Royal. I love it. I mean, honestly, for me, Latrice Royal can do no wrong. I like the hair size for her proportion. She's proportionized. <laughs> I, mean, I like the colors on her. I like the fact that she knows her body. And for a big girl, she has these lines going down instead of diagonal, so it makes it seem like she's slimmer in the body. So good job, Latrice. I love that she has a shoulder pad. Very much highlight that hourglass. Yeah, I, I love, love that. the hair. I love the fact that she wears big hair, you know what I mean? Yeah. And she got the accessories in the right places, the right amount. The only thing I would say are the shoes. I think the shoes are really screaming at me, like, help. I think the shoes, <laughs> not the, <laughs> I think the shoes like, are. Like, help me! I think help I think it me. should be. Help! Help me! <laughs> <laughs> so I think the whole look is very cohesive, but the shoes, for some reason, is just winking at me, winking at me, winking at me. I and think I that's think, the toes, girl. And I think the shoes should be gold and black. I guess if she was gonna do a gold shoe, she would need even more dramatic accessories. Yes. You know, like really big gold bangles or yeah, bracelets. That's the, thing. the necklace is okay, but I don't see much of an earring. The it's shoes are a little too loud. The hair, probably. Yeah, probably. Probably. Um, I, it's like a soft two for me. I'm gonna give it a two. I'm sorry, Latrice can do no wrong for me. The next. It's me. Valentina. Oh, 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 oh. Ding, 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 oh, ding, 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 oh, hold on, my picture. Oh, oh, girl. Are you for real? I'm dead serious. Ow. You know, how, ooh, you know how like it like catches. No, I'm a woman. What, Miss Singh? Why you lie? <sighs> okay, thank you. Wow. Okay. The next ooh, that was is Valentina. Okay. It's me, Valentina. Valentina. So this photo is by Yusef Bab. Oh, she got photographers and things. Yes, girl, she got money, honey. Oh, oh. The dress is beautiful, but I would do it with no necklace and then bigger earrings, hair a little bit shorter and a little bit more bumpier and fuller at the top. What do you I'm think? I'm sorry, mom. You want bigger earrings? Yes, bigger earrings. I, for Valentina, this is a big earring, I feel. Knowing Valentina, this is this actually is a, big, a earring? big earring. For okay, her. I would do even a bigger, maybe like Damn. twice the size. Yeah. She said, I need this wearing a Cadillac rim. Mm -hmm. But still looks gorgeous though. <laughs> Whoever made this garment, the beadwork where it's wrapping underneath beautiful. her breast and it's coming around her body, it contours her curve beautifully. The fringe is giving her that extra bit of hip. Exactly. I mean, her body shape is on point. Exactly. Um, the black color with the black hair, it's a little monochromatic and it does kind of blend, so I get it. You cannot clock that mug. Exactly. She you looks literally beautiful, can. girl. I mean, Gorgeous. Valentina is, she's perfect. She's beautiful. She's perfect. She's beautiful. She looks like Linda Evangelista. She's a model. Did you stone your face? Yes. But you know what? For DragCon, right? I uh -huh. saw her for the first time ever during last year, during DragCon LA. Yeah. And I have to say, she blew my mind away. I've seen her on TV, on Instagram before, photos, but in person, Oh my God, a complete doll in person. She is pretty. Stop. Now, 
talk to you. I am listening with all of my heart, darling. That's why I'm sweating. <laughs> But I would nonetheless give this look a toot. I, it's a shoot for me, I have to. And she really knows how to pose in photos. I, oh my God, she's the she's woman. Like, she's the only telenovela goddess that I've ever seen. Miss Pheromone, my Hi, baby. Hi, And guess what, I'm wearing her favorite color today. Pink. Pink. Yeah, she no loves idea. pink. Pheromone. She loves, loves, loves pink. Oh my God, this look of Pheromone is beautiful, honestly. Absolutely stunning. I love I the mean, earrings, I love the makeup. She's got a big old jewel on. Mm -hmm. the The gown's gorgeous. She's I love got her the first stole. Lips on. The white hair is lovely. The first stole's wrapped right. Mm -hmm. I think that the dress is really beautiful. I love the see through moment. I think that the panty cut could be a little better underneath the dress. It's a see through dress. Yes, I think the panties um, could be a little bit higher, maybe. Like maybe a higher hip. To yeah, higher like hip. The silhouette yeah. a little better. Um, I think the rhinestoning is beautiful. The, this uh, brocade print of sequin is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Ceremony does no wrong to you me. You know what I think, I mean, she looks gorgeous now, but you know what I think I would have done if I were to wear a dress like that, especially with the stones? I would have snatched my hair up and maybe into a ponytail. Oh yeah, I can you see that. You know what that. I mean? So you can see the face and also the gorgeousness yeah. of the gown. Um, I definitely toot, toot of the toot, 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 pheromone. And I will give this photo a toot as well. Next up we have... Miss Trinity the Tuck, a photo by Indigo Capri. Isn't that her boyfriend? Yes, girl, they met oh, girl. after the show, girl. Oh yeah. Do you remember at the reunion? No, I heard all about it. Girl. Um, I like the look. I think that the craftsmanship of this jacket and the skirt is beautiful. I don't know who made it. The silhouette is right. I would the love to The zipper is it. flat and smooth. I think that the adornments on it are beautiful. It accentuates her hips. I am not the hugest fan of the hat for me. I think that the coloration with that little bit of an Aur Ouroboralis moment that's shining. What'd you say? Over Aurora Borealis, right? Okay, I, 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 I heard you said it was Aurora Aurora. I like Trinity the fact that she is a pageant girl and she loves to experiment with color. You know what I mean? Most yeah. pageant girls, you'll see them wearing like <laughs> evening gowns, big hair, big jewelry. But yeah. you know what? She don't give a f girl. She don't you give know. a f I'm gonna play yeah. with pink hair if I wanna care. This is probably one of the hundredth photos she's put out on her social yes. media. Yes, she's put out a lot of photos. But the thing is, is I've seen so many beautiful pictures from Trinity that, um, and garments and looks, exactly. that this is not my favorite, I have to boot it. I give it a toot. I give it a boot. It's Monet Exchange! Cha -ching, cha -ching, cha -ching. Come on, Monet Exchange. Um, I like the hair, I'm... I like the shoes. The outfit, it is hard to tell by the way she's positioned onto that couch or chair. I love that Monet Exchange is gorgeous, first of all. I mean, she is literally. That sounds like there's like a. Okay, oh, there's, there's some talking. butts. Okay. There's some butts. I think the hair is incredible. I don't know who did this hair, but I need it. I think the accessories are, uh, you know, I don't. It's a bit Forever 21. For me, it's, it's a little awkward. It's a little awkward. There's a lot going on. We've got red hair. We've got blue shoes. We've got a white, you know, garment. I'm, I'm assuming it's a dress that has a lot of tool happening underneath it. Uh, we've got gold bracelets mixed with silver bracelets. And we've got, it's a boot. Her mug is a two. I think if she was standing up, maybe it would show the dress a little bit better. If she's sitting down, it doesn't give the outfit a really good look of the structure of it all. From the neck up, it's a shoot. From the yes. neck down, it's a boot. It's a boot. Next up, we have, I got something to say. It's Jasmine Masters. Honey, come on, zhuzh. Um, I, I think it's a toot. What do you think? I know Jasmine Masters as a drag queen. She's like yes. one of the few queens that does like high, like drag. Like she will literally come in and give you the only Patti LaBelle. She looks beautiful here. Toot. She looks beautiful. The toot. hair is lovely. Toot, uh, toot, toot. It's toot, yeah. It's a shoot for me. Actually, it's a shoot, actually. It's a shoot. I love the black stonework in the blue yes. with the black earring. The attention yes. to detail is gorgeous. The hair's waved right. Mm -hmm. It makes her face look slim and feminine. It's taking away any type of broad shoulderness that she might have with this hip, and that extra stitched, featherness. Honey. I mean, literally the feather detail down the sides makes yes. that waist even smaller. Yes, girl. You know, Good Jasmine job. Skinny. She's a small girl. Oh my god. Okay, so up next is Monique Hart, the heart of season 10. Yes, from our season. Another girl uh -huh. from RuPaul's Drag Race season Two 10. girls from season 10 exactly. on All Stars 4. Wow. Exactly. Girl, brown cow, stunning. Brown cow, stunning. I'm a production. Facts are facts, America. Cock -a -cock -a -cock -a -cock. I mean, literally, she was 
the dialogue queen of season 10. Exactly. She was the narration we all wanted to hear. Exactly. She literally always had the cute things to say. Exactly. And she also lives for the lore. She is not scared to play with colors. A mama paints. Yes. She's a painted queen. Yes. I love this look on her. I think this is showing her elevation. You know, she's coming into her own as a style fashion queen. Yes. This might be a leotard with chaps and a mug that she probably did a dance number in this. Yes. That pointed shoulder pad is bringing it up so that yep. it still gives her a silhouette that makes her yep. look feminine. Yep. I think that the waist is cinched just right. Yep. The gloved uh, hands bring it all the way snatched that gives it that fashion element. Mm -hmm. Exactly. She's she is not fashion. scared to take fashion and make it campy. Oh, honey, Miley Cyrus is screaming. Right? Honey, Bikala is screaming. Those, my lashes are like, bye girl, those are the real lashes. Literally. I wonder what they made it out. I know, I don't know. I love it, it's a toot. I'm sorry, I was picking my nose. I give this a toot. Next, Manila Luzon. Photo by Magnus Hastings. You know, Manila is one of those queens too for me that I think always has a style aesthetic that says, this is Manila Luzon. And she's always Obviously done with her from hair. head to toe. Oh, always from head, head to toe. to toe. It's but always one look, it's always one look. The earring is just small enough to make the big necklace work. Yes. I think that the cut of the dress is beautiful. Yes. The high cut is perfect with the white shoe, mm -hmm. with the white dipped into that foxtail hang. Mm -hmm. We've got minimal jewelry with the white gloves. I mean, it makes the white shoe perfect. I give it a shoot. I mean, I think that it's literally just gorgeous from head to toe. Oh my God, are those little furry so things So classic. In the back? What is that? She's got a white fuzz ball on her shoe. Everything about this photo from head to toe is too. Yeah, her legs look beautiful. Her mug looks gorgeous. What I can't wait to see is Latrilla. Latrilla! Latrice and Manila back. I cannot back. wait for her to slay this competition! Ja-ja-ja-ja-ja, the boom boom gun. Oh my God. Latina mas Latina. Our first open trans women contestants on RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars. Yes! We obviously had Peppermint, but she came out on the show. What I love about Gia Gunn is she has literally marketed herself and made herself last, and she's still working. She's mm -hmm. one of those girls that everyone knows. You know what I mean? And she has definitely has a huge glow up since season six. Yeah. Look at her makeup. Gorgeous. Oh, gorgeous. Gorgeous. The lines in this garment is perfect. I love the way it cuts right underneath the bust and the pattern changes just enough to make it give separation. Exactly. If this pattern went all the way down, it wouldn't be as interesting. Look at that body, honey. Oh yeah. I think the lines of this is great. I give it a toot to the toot toot. I'm gonna tell you why. Okay. This is why I give it a toot. The earrings are beautiful. I was just about to mention the earrings. The earrings are beautiful. They make her look so grand and rich, girl. They like look she's rich. Expensive. Girl from the Upper East Side, darling. I give this look a toot. I give it a toot. I think it's beautiful. I mean, Gia Gunn's beautiful. Exactly. J J um, Gia. but you know what? It could be better. How? It could be better. How? It's just good. Trend alert! Glow, glow up. up. Just in time for All Stars oh. 4. Ooh, snow glow. Transforming. Ooh, glowy. Rhinestone. 360 degree round angle life change. Yes. Y'all better Fabulous. step your oh. yeah. Ah. Trend alert, step your yeah. That's what it really is. That's what they really did. That's girl. what it really is. And, and on top two of the week is Miss Judge herself, Miss Jasmine, Jasmine Masters. Masters. Ah! Serving blue, black diamond hair. She, I'm, I'm high looking at her. You top two of the week. And just as I thought, toot of the week. <laughs> that was funny. So make sure you tune in December 14th to watch RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars 4. Why don't you all check the link below and see if RuPaul's Drag Race All-Stars 4 is airing in your territory. Let's get sickening All-Stars. Bam! 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 Sorry, I was picking my nose.